啊！This is that night. All of the islands you grew up on were sundered, scattered. Many hearts were forever lost to the darkness because of what you did. <clears throat> you hated being an islander, so you opened the door to darkness and destroyed the islands. It was you. You were pulled into the darkness then, and now you belong to the darkness. You should look. Look at what you truly are. Sora? Don't you recognize me? Yeah, I recognize you. I can see exactly what you've become. <laughs> How can the light hurt you? Riku, have you really become a creature of the dark? You're not Riku anymore. You're just a pawn of the darkness. So be it. It's time for you to face the light. I'm fading. Fading away into the light. You won't fade. You can't fade. There's no power that can defeat you. Not the light. Not the dark. So don't run from the light. And don't fear the darkness. Because both will make you stronger. Make me stronger? Darkness too? Yeah, strength that's yours. The darkness inside your heart, it's vast and it's deep. But if you can, truly stare into it and never try to look away. You won't be afraid of anything again. All this time I've tried to push the darkness away. You've got to just remember to be brave. Know that the darkness is there and don't give in. If you do that, you will gain strength. The kind that's unlike any other. You'll be able to escape the deepest darkness. And I'll be able to see through the brightest light. Follow the darkness. It'll show you the way to your friends. Can I face them? You don't want to? You know I do. Of course. And I will. With my strength. My dark strength. Darkness! <laughs> Damn! Impossible! How is it that you found me, when you were there in the light? You reek of darkness. Even the light can't block the smell. <gasps> I guess I followed the darkness right to you. This is absurd. Then I shall make you see that your hopes are nothing, nothing but a mere illusion! Uh, 
After all your protests, you're still like us on the side of darkness. I know who I am. When did that happen? You were always terrified of the dark before. Not anymore! <gasps> He... no one's ever won the darkness the way that he does. It's impossible! <gasps> oh yes, the replica, of course. We can use this Riku to defeat the real one. Axel? Wouldn't you like to be real? All you need is the kind of power that the real Riku doesn't have. If you can get that, you can be a new person, not Riku, nor anybody else. You won't just be a copy of someone, you will be unique, your own self. Axel! What are you saying to him? You know, he's as good a place to start as any. You can't do this! No! 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 So sorry, Zexion. <laughs> you just found out way too much. Riku. Riku. Who's there? I know you can feel it. The grip that I have on your heart. <gasps> you have led in the darkness, Riku. That means very soon your heart shall become an all-consuming darkness. I'm not like that now. Yes, you are. <gasps> Can't move! The deeper the darkness runs inside you, the stronger I become. Controlling you is effortless. <laughs> Must you interfere again? Yeah. <sighs> Ooh, sure glad I made it in time. Gotta keep Ansem busy for a while, huh? Sorry I couldn't come here sooner, Riku. Your Majesty, is it you? Uh-huh. Whoa! <laughs> that tickles! <laughs> this time, you're not an illusion. I'm so glad that you can make it here. I made a promise to you that I would find a way, didn't I? Oh. Ah, uh, I'm okay. Don't worry. Guess I'm just relieved. I've... I've been alone so long. And having someone else around is... That's a little... Overwhelming. But, uh, how did you make it here? I thought it was too far. I found a card to help me. I needed a way out of the realm of darkness. And then suddenly this card appeared right in front of me. When I picked it up, I could see your heart beyond the darkness. That's what let me find you. I guess the card thought its place was to be with you. Maybe you are right. Where am I? 
What is this place? Oh, your majesty? You must battle me all alone. Against my dark powers. <sighs> What's this? Are you giving up? Finally ready to surrender to your fate? You're not the true Ansem. Oh. Mm. Your scent is different. The Ansem in my heart smells darker. The odor is more foul. But... Your scent just isn't that. It's not darkness. It's something else. I finally understand. You're the one who guided me, when it started. You came to me pretending to be Ansem. You gave me the card. To make me face the darkness. Hmm. That, that is, is correct. correct. Is or so I am known. You, I've watched you all along. Really? Who are you? And what do you want from me? For you to choose. Choose? You are a special entity. You exist between light and dark. You stand in the twilight. You are to meet Namine, then choose. Namine? Who's that? You will know soon. <gasps> Maybe Namine is here. Hold it! <gasps> You've changed. Your own darkness. It doesn't frighten you anymore. How can you tell? Because I'm you. No, I'm me. I'm me, he says. Must be nice being real. A fake like me could never get away with saying that. That's right! I'm a phony! A fake! The way I look, the way I feel, everything I remember! And even... this newfound power! Huh? I thought by finding some new strength, I could finally be someone... someone who's not at all you! But... nothing changes. I'm still just empty! Everything about me is borrowed. As long as you're around, I'll never be more than a shadow! So... It's over. <laughs> Death doesn't frighten me. Good riddance to a phony life. My heart was... Never real. I'm sure even what I'm feeling now is probably all fake. What are you feeling? What happens when a fake dies? One like me. Where will my heart go? Does it disappear? It'll go somewhere. Maybe to the same place as mine. <laughs> A faithful replica until the very end. That's... okay.
Are you Namine? Yes. I see. That was you. Huh? Forget it. Nothing. Please, come this way. Huh? Sora! What have you done to Sora? Nothing. He's just asleep. To get his memory back. So, Sora chose to forget about this castle, and get his old memories back? You have a choice to make, too. Why me, too? No one's messed with my memories. It's not your memories. It's your darkness. In your heart there is darkness, and in that darkness is Ansem. He may be at bay for now, but eventually he'll wake. And he will take over you just like he did before. But I have powers you can use. With my powers, I can put a tight lock on your heart. That way, Ansem could never come out from inside you. What happens to me if I let you do that? Will I forget? Everything? Like Sora? I'll have to. The darkness in you will be sealed tight just like your memory. You'll stop remembering the darkness. You'll go back to how you were. Riku, please choose. He doesn't even look worried. Will I sleep like that too? Yes. Figures. Sora always did as he pleased. Whatever we'd be doing together, he'd find a way to slack off. Even trying to leave the islands. I did all the work on the raft by myself. That's it. When this slacker wakes up, I'll tell him off. I told him to take care of Kyrie, and here he is just taking a nap. But I can't chew him out like he deserves. If I've been asleep. <laughs> I don't need my heart locked. I'm ready. I'm gonna fight Ansem. But what if his darkness overtakes you? If that happens, then the darkness will show me the way. Yes. That's true. <laughs> Why do I get the feeling that you knew I would say that? I didn't know. I hoped. I wanted you to face the darkness. Because you're the one who can. So that's the reason. That's why you came to my rescue inside that light. In the form of Kyrie. When'd you know? I knew when I met you. You and Kyrie smell the same. Look after Sora. Gosh, I guess you decided not to go to sleep. How'd you know that? I heard it from Diz. <gasps> Do you know him? Well, I'm not sure. Got a feeling that I've met him somewhere. Hey. Who are you? I could be nobody, or anybody. It is up to you whether you choose to believe in me or not. Boy, you really like pushing decisions on other people. And you have pushed away slumber, making the choice to face Ansem. Do you think I'm reckless? You have chosen your own path. Are you supporting me? Or are you abandoning me? That will be your choice as well. What's this? 
The organization will pursue you. Like a pack of hunting dogs, they will sneak up on you if they sense your presence. However, this cloak that is worn by nobodies will render their eyes and their noses useless. The ears, not so. They wear this to give themselves protection from being devoured by darkness. Is it clear? Even the organization cannot rule the darkness. Doesn't matter. I won't run from the darkness. Hmm. The card will draw out your heart's darkness. Finish your business with Ansem. Come on. Let's go. He said this card will draw Ansem out. Don't worry. We can defeat him together. Sorry. I've got to face him alone. But why? There's no point in doing this if I can't do it on my own. But I do need a favor. If Ansem is the victor, he is going to enslave me. If that happens, use your powers to destroy- Of course! I'll be right there to save you. Huh? No, th that's not it. I want you to destroy- No way! No matter what happens, I'm gonna be right there to help you. I promise you that. Unless you don't believe I'll come through for you. I choose to believe in you. Always, Your Majesty. And I in you. You're not gonna lose. I know it. Thanks. Ansem! Where are you? Show yourself! <laughs> Why in such a hurry? I'll be here at the very heart of darkness. Watching you plunge into the same darkness inside of you. <laughs> I smell you, Ansem. Show yourself! I have watched you fight. I know your strength. Your skill with darkness has grown. It has become more mature. And yet, why? Why do you accept the darkness? but still refuse me. You know you and I are similar. We both follow where the darkness leads. Indeed, we are the same. So why? Does some part of your heart still have a fear of the dark? That's not it. The truth is, I just can't stand your foul stench! You are a fool. You should know my powers well by now. Yeah, I know. Or did you forget? I used all the power you had to give, and Sora still beat me. I'm not at all impressed with your powers. Very well. In that case, you shall sink into the abyss!
Insolent rat! Handsome! This is... the end. This... is hardly... the end. Your darkness... I gave it all to you. My dark shadow lingers. Someday, someday, I will return! Sora. Kyrie. Gosh, Riku, I know you wanted to do this alone, but you don't mind getting a little help, do ya? So, Riku, what happens next? Are you going home? I can't go home. Not yet. It's still here. It's really faint, but I can sense him. So, I think his darkness may still have a hold on me. Your darkness belongs to you, just the same way your light does. Up till now, I thought darkness was something that should never exist. Then, I spent time with you and changed my mind. The road you chose, I didn't know. Light and dark, back to back. With you, I think they might meet in a way nobody's seen before. Wonder where that road leads. I'd like to see myself. Huh? I'd like to walk the road with you. <laughs> Your Majesty, I'm really flattered. I don't know what to say. Gosh, Riku, you know you don't have to call me that now. We're pals. Fair enough, Mickey. What are you making me choose now? Between the road to light and the road to darkness. Neither suits me. I'm taking the middle road. Do you mean the twilight road to nightfall? No. It's the road to dawn. Hey, Axel? If you're looking for Axel, he's gone. What do I do with this?
This place is so much nicer. Without the loudmouths. Loudmouths? Those bossy co-workers sent to Castle Oblivion. Oh. Well, I suppose it's too bad you and Poppet didn't get to spend a little more quality time with him. Poppet? I'm talking about Shion, kiddo. Kiddo? Roxas, get to work. I've got some place to be again today. So go on ahead without me. R Roxas. Huh? Shion? Roxas is your name. Yeah. Roxas. Best of luck today. Oh, uh, yeah. Let's go. Wow, I... Shion, I didn't know you could use the Keyblade. You know... Neither did I. <laughs> <laughs> you earned the icing on the cake. Huh? Come on, I'll show you. This is such a great spot. How'd you find it? Here you go. Sea salt ice cream. Come on, try it. Mm. It's sweet. And salty. It's good, right? Axel and I, we meet here for ice cream after work. This flavor is Axel's favorite. Sounds like it's yours, too. Yeah. Axel brought me here to eat ice cream on my first day with the organization. And then, after my first mission, he got me ice cream again. Said it was icing on the cake. Like you just did for me. Yeah. You guys must be really close. Well, Axel and I are friends. Friends? Do you think that I could be a friend? When Axel gets back, we'll all have ice cream together. Okay. Is it true then, about Castle Oblivion? That's none of your concern. And Axel? Gone. He may have disappeared for good. What? Hey, what happens when Heartless are destroyed? The hearts remain. And then... Those hearts gather together to form the Great Kingdom Hearts. Then, can you tell me what remains if a nobody is destroyed? What's there to leave behind? We're not even supposed to be in the first place. And the members at Castle Oblivion, where'd they go? Nothing's left of them. In which case, I'll never see them again? That's right. <sighs> You coming? Huh? Oh, yeah. Uh -huh.
What's happening? Will he wake from this? I am told Roxas will return, provided the hero is stripped of all his memories. Then I suppose much hinges on Castle Oblivion. Shion has gained power over the Keyblade, just as we intended. She can fill Roxas's shoes for the time being. I went to a new world today, Roxas. I couldn't believe how beautiful it was. I hope that you can join me next time. Well, I'll see you tomorrow, Roxas. I knew that I'd find you snoozing down here. Roxas? Shion. What happened to me? You were sleeping for a long time. Sayak said there was no telling when you might wake up. But I'm glad you did. I kind of feel like a zombie, though. <laughs> <laughs> I brought you this. Huh? It's a seashell. I've been picking one up on every mission. Hold it up to your ear. Hey, Roxas. Oh. It's been a while. What's the matter? You look like you've seen a ghost. Axel. I heard everyone at Castle Oblivion was annihilated. Not me. I'm tough. You had me worried. Worry? We nobodies don't have the hearts to worry, you know? I'll go buy us some ice cream. 
I gotta check in with the boss. Or he's gonna let me have it. You haven't reported back yet? Hmm? No. Why'd you come here? I guess I just needed a little time to sort out my feelings, you know? I thought you didn't have a heart. Hmm? <laughs> hey, your ice cream's melting. Eat up. Oh. You know, I started inviting Shion up here while you were gone. Shion? I made her a promise. The three of us could have ice cream when you got back. Shion. She's my friend too. Why didn't you report in? What? Not even one little word of appreciation? The only thing I've heard is that Namine has gone missing. There one minute, gone the next. I don't know how she got out. Did you search every room? Are you kidding? You know as well as I do that searching through every room there is impossible. And the chamber? Did you find it? Come on, I would have told you that much. I gotta hand it to you. About Marluxia being one of the traitors, you knew exactly what was up from the start. Hm. I merely rounded up and sent off the ones who were getting in the way. Whoa there. Was I one of those you wanted to erase? Good to see you made it back safe. I disposed of Zexion, by the way. I moved things along just the way you wanted. At least for now. You know, you're more cheerful. You really think so? I was thinking the same about you. Yeah, well, I guess. He must have rubbed off on me. Huh? Nah, <laughs> it's thanks to you that we get to sit here again and laugh while having ice cream. <laughs> I wonder if Shion's gonna show today. We have to take that thing out first. <laughs> Shion, are you okay? Roxas? Easy. Are you hurt? I'm fine. Thank you. It's just... You can tell us all about it. But why don't we head back first? There you go. Thank you. Eat up. It's gonna melt. Yeah. What's wrong? I thought you'd wolf it down. Did something happen? We're here for you if you want to get it off your chest. Right, Roxas? <sighs> He's right. That's what friends are for. I can't... I can't use the Keyblade anymore. And without the Keyblade... I can't do my job. What exactly happened? I don't know. But 
But if I don't defeat Heartless with the Keyblade, the hearts they release will just find their way into other Heartless instead. I swat them in one place, and they just pop up in another. My mission is to go out and collect hearts. If I'm unable to use the Keyblade, I'll... I'll be useless. Is there anything you can do, Axel? I wish there was, but... It's just like she said. Without the Keyblade, she can't collect hearts. And once they... find out... They're gonna turn me into a dusk. We can't do anything? I already told you, there's nothing we can... Hold on... Did you think of something? Roxas... You can work double duty. Huh? What do you mean? Shion, make sure your missions are with Roxas. Until you can use the Keyblade again. That way, he can collect the hearts and no one will know that you can't use the Keyblade. That's it! But... That means you have to collect twice as many hearts. Yeah, I can do it. Would you? Of course I would. But... Friends need to lean on each other every now and then. Ain't that right, Roxas? We're friends. Axel, does that mean you and I are friends, too? Well, if you're friends with Roxas, then yeah, of course you're my friend. Thank you, Roxas, Axel. Just eat your ice cream. So best friends are different from plain friends, right? They're about the same. Best friends, huh? But I'd say, best friends are a notch above just plain friends. So how are they different? I don't know. I couldn't tell you because I don't have any best friends. I see. has arrived. And at long last we see before us the great collection of hearts. Hearts full of rage, hate, sadness, and bliss. Shining down upon us is the crystallization of all hearts. Kingdom hearts. There, in the sky, hangs the promise of a new world. My friends, let us gain further power to conquer the human heart and claim it as our own. Let us remember why we are here and what we hope to achieve. Hearts shall be gathered and be made our own. Hearts shall never again have power over us. All this fighting, I wonder what it's for. Come on, you know what it's for. We have to complete the great Kingdom Hearts. You saw it too, didn't you? But what is Kingdom Hearts? It's the gathering place of hearts, isn't it? It's where all the hearts wind up after they're released by you. When we gather enough, we might finally get hearts of our own. Hearts shall be made our own. Is Kingdom Hearts really that important? Are you crazy? 
I just don't see why having a heart is that important, you know? Come on. You're wondering about that now? Well, I don't understand since I don't have a heart. Roxas. We'll understand once we have our own hearts. That's why we fight to find out what it's about. Okay. I guess you're right. It looks like every nobody in the organization is good at different things. That's right. Everybody's unique. Even nobody's without hearts? Just because we don't all have hearts doesn't mean that we're all exactly the same. We each have memories of our pasts. Memories? You remember your past? Yeah, that's one of the things that makes each member of the organization special. We remember who we were as humans. But I don't. Me neither. Well, maybe that right there is what makes you guys the most unique in the organization. What were you like before you were a nobody? Huh? Me? Oh, I don't know. I think I've always been pretty much the same. I wish I could remember stuff like that. Really? It's just baggage, you know. But I... I can't remember anything, not even from when I was born a nobody. All you did was stare into space. Oh, thanks! <laughs> <laughs> you know, I don't remember much either. You two sure do have a lot in common. I wonder what kind of guy I was before. Thanks, Roxas. You can have this back. Do you remember anything? I don't know. But let me try again. You did it! Roxas, it worked! I can't wait to tell Axel this! Let's go! Yeah! <sighs> Axel! Whoa! Where'd you come from? <laughs> <laughs> How was your mission? You know, I sure wish the Heartless would hold still once in a while. I fell right on my butt chasing him around. I thought you said you were tough. Yeah, whatever. That's got nothing to do with it. So, how did your caper go? <laughs> Ta-da! <gasps> Roxas, Axel, thank you. I didn't do anything. You made it possible for the two of us to go on a mission together. If it weren't for you, Shion might never have remembered how to use the Keyblade. So thanks, Axel. How about a sea salt ice cream then? Huh? Buy me one and we'll call it even. You got it. I'll be right back. <laughs> I hope we can always be just like this forever. Me too. What's that all about? I just want these days to last forever. Hanging out, the ice cream, the sunsets. Well, nothing lasts forever, you know. Least of all for a bunch of nobodies like us. But it's okay if things change and we can't meet up here. 
Huh? As long as we keep each other in our thoughts, none of us will ever have to be apart. Got it memorized? <laughs> wow, that was so not you. Hey! <laughs> <laughs> Ever heard of knocking? What do you want? Tell me what Shion has been doing. Well, how should I know? I'm not spying on her. The two of you look pretty close. So what? Now I've got a rat on my friends to you? I think you should just go. Today you and Shion will be going on the same mission. Well, thank you, sir, for personally delivering that message to me. We also need you to go back to Castle Oblivion soon, says Lord Zemnis. That castle hasn't given up all its secrets. One even he doesn't know of its whereabouts. Even he doesn't know. You mean the chamber, right? We turn that place inside out. If it's there, we're not going to find it just by looking. Then let me give you another reason. Shion comes from the castle, to which Namine can be traced. Uh. The place where both Namine and Shion were born, it's practically calling out for you. <laughs> Whatever. As far as the castle goes, you're the one who really wants to go there. By finding the room that Xemnas is searching for, you would find out everything about Xemnas's true agenda, am I right? The Chamber of Repose as well as the Chamber of Waking. Xemnas has an agenda that he hasn't told to anybody. And we are bound to find some clues in the Chamber of Waking. And once we obtain those clues, we'll have the upper hand for our own objectives. I knew the time would come when Vexen and Zexion got in your way. That's why I took the initiative and cleared the way to the top for you. I can handle all the dirty work. You go all the way to the top. You will be going on a solo mission to Castle Oblivion. Expect the orders soon. Castle Oblivion. Namine. And Shion. Roxas is late today. Hope Zigbar isn't giving him too hard of a time. Yeah, right? You know what, Axel? Hmm? When I sit here and talk with you guys, I get the strangest feeling that a long time ago, I used to watch the sunset with somebody else. It's the same when I watch the sea. Some place by the sea, where I hear the sound of the waves, I get the feeling that I was talking with someone. So you mean that you have memories of your past? No, it's not quite like that. I don't know. What do you think? Are these memories? Hmm. I wouldn't know either. You have memories, don't you? 
Yeah, sorta. Though it's not like they've ever really done me any good. Roxas is like me. Neither one of us remembers much. I wonder if he and I had this much in common before we were nobodies. I knew you'd be here. Axel! <gasps> Slept like a log. <laughs> Are the kids here on summer vacation already? Nah. Can't be. It's much too early. Summer vacation? What's that? It's a dream come true, that's what where they get a whole month off. A month off? I wouldn't know what to do with that much time. I can't even figure out how to fill a day. You'd be surprised. They give you plenty of homework, and of course, you have to play with your friends every day. Trust me, it's over before you can blink. Hmm. I could deal with seven days, maybe. Most kids spend the time just goofing off with their friends. They save the homework till the end, and then help each other finish it. That sounds fun, I guess. Hanging around with friends is fun. I'd forgotten all that since becoming a nobody, I guess. So, how did you spend your day? Hey guys, how did I know you'd be here? Where did you go, Shion? I didn't go anywhere. What about you two? Did you guys go somewhere without me? Axel says he was asleep all day. What? What's that about? You wasted a day off? Unlike you two, Lazy Bones, I work hard. So I'm tired, okay? Unlike me and Roxas, maybe you're just out of shape. <laughs> 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 Tomorrow, it's back to work. Yeah. Hope we get another vacation soon. Oh yeah, I might not see you guys again for a while. Huh? They're sending me out on recon for a few days. Where? Can't tell. What's up with that? It's a secret mission. But I thought we were friends. Hey, I'm not about to tell you all my dark secrets. Got it memorized? Dark secrets? Haha! <laughs> I'm kidding. I just gotta keep my mouth shut about it or else Syx will get on my case. You know how he can get. Yeah. Try not to bungle everything while I'm gone, huh? Now why would we do that? Well, considering your track record, I just can't count on you guys. Hey! <laughs> We can handle things just fine. That's right. Just you watch. <laughs> <laughs> What took you so long? <clears throat> it's my vacation. I can take all the time I want. Since when do I have to check in with you? You're letting yourself get too attached to them. Yeah, yeah. Whatever you say. You know, you've changed. Hey! Roxas! Axel! You're back! Yep, I just got home. So, are you holding up? Yeah. Where's she on? She's not here yet. Hmm. 
She's usually here by now. This isn't like her. How could he? I'm not a sham. Just give me... another chance. We can't afford to take any more chances on you. You were a mistake we never should have made. Shion? Where's she on? Haven't seen her today. Oh well. Axel. Hmm? Is there anything you couldn't bear to lose? Anything I couldn't bear to lose? What's that about? Well, I met someone today who had something like that. This thing was so important to him he couldn't bear to lose it. And Zaldan said that was his weakness. Why don't I have anything like that? It's because you don't have a heart. I guess. But Demix doesn't have a heart. And I bet huh? he'd get upset if he took <laughs> his sitar away. Huh. I think you have a point there. So you don't need a heart to have something that you can't bear to lose then. If that's true, then I guess the closest thing that we nobodies have would be memories of our past. It's the memories that create the things that we don't want to lose. Memories of the past? I don't remember my past. Even though you might not remember the past, I'm sure you have things you don't want to lose. Like what? You've got memories since you joined us, right? I don't know. I do. Don't I? I couldn't bear to lose my memories of you or Shion. So then you really do have something that you can't bear to lose, right? Every one of us. Including us nobodies. We all have something that we want to hang on to. It's scary. You can't be scared without a heart. If my friends... If you or Shion were to disappear... It's... Scary to think of what it would be like without you guys. Scared is not an emotion that can exist inside us. Well, I am scared right now for sure. Maybe it's just that you remember what it's like to be scared, you know? Somewhere deep inside your memories. I wonder where Axel is. Guess we got the work done a little too fast, huh?
face. Who are you really? And why do you have a Keyblade? Tell me first, why you are dressed as one of us. To make sure my best friend sleeps in peace. I don't know who you're supposed to be, but you can't fight fire with sparks. This Keyblade is a sham. Worthless. My Keyblade is not a sham. What gives you the right to say that? Find a new crowd. Trust me, those guys are bad news. Why? You're the real sham! Fair enough. You could say I am the biggest nobody of them all. Something wrong? Sorry. My mind's on other things. Roxas, do you ever think about why we're doing all of this? What do you mean, why? So we can get hearts of our own, right? But what do we need hearts for? I don't know. But I think once we have hearts, we probably won't have to think about why we're doing all this. Or if we need hearts. I'm not sure. I just wish... I knew what I was doing here. I started having the strangest dreams. Like nightmares? I can never remember what they're about. I just... wake up scared. Zigbar said you and me were pretty special. Exceptional, he said. Special? Isn't that... just another way of saying that I'm a mistake? You're not a mistake. Well, you and I may both be exceptional, Roxas, but... I don't think we're quite the same. Hey, Roxas. Axel. Shion couldn't make it again today? Actually, you just missed her. Hey, that was uncalled for. I told you, keep out of this. And I'm telling you that I have to know what's the deal with Shion. If there's something going on, just be straight with me for once, will ya? Do you mean just like you are always honest with me? <sighs> well, you got me there, I guess. Shion has no right to be among our number. <sighs> what do you mean? It's plain to see. I have nothing more to say.
<gasps> Whoa! Uh, good morning, Xion. Oh, morning? You woke up so suddenly, you just startled me. So sorry Oh. Did you bring me these seashells? Do you hear it? Yeah. The sound of the waves. How long was I asleep? About 20 days. That long? Yeah. You were sleeping so much that me and Axel were getting worried. I'm sorry about that. Kind of weird that we can feel anything at all. Without having hearts to feel with. Uh... Hey, Roxas. Don't you have work today? Huh? Oh, uh, I'm about to head out. I'd like to tag along. But don't you need some more rest? I'll be fine. Come on, take me with you. Uh, all right. Sure. <laughs> Shion! It's my lucky charm. Be sure to bring it back to me. <sighs> Leave Xion to me! Got it! Well, that didn't take long. Did it break again? She's not an it! Keep your mouth shut. You have changed. What happened at Castle Oblivion? Does the past mean nothing to you? Are you worried about her, Axel? Of course I am. It just doesn't seem like you. What do you mean? I mean, you don't like things to be complicated. You know, Roxas, each day, the three of us meet up there for ice cream. Now, why do you think that is? Huh? I mean, if you think about it, I don't need to go out of my way to meet you guys, right? I don't know. You want me to tell you why? It's because you guys are my best friends. We are? Get it memorized, all right? We are best friends. Oh, yeah. Guess we are. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, Axel. You're sweet. Uh, <laughs> are you feeling better? I just got a little dizzy, that's all. Sorry to worry you guys. Don't scare us like that anymore. Mm -hmm. Just take it easy today. I will. Thanks, both of you.
You seem to be struggling. And nobody is interfering, I think. A nobody? I keep trying to piece his memory back together. But what if some of the pieces got lost? There would be no way for me to finish. If that happened, and they found their way into someone else, he'd never get them back. Oh, I think he can do without a memory or two. But what... what if he needs those memories in order to wake up? What if they're the key? Namine, you're a witch who has power over Sora's memories, and those connected to him. Are you seeing something I cannot? If his memories become her memories, she will never survive it. She? Hey, Axel? Hmm? You've been to Castle Oblivion, right? Yeah. Hmm. What is it like? What's it like? Just an organization research facility. For research, huh? Seems everyone gets sent there all the time, especially you. Although... They never send me a Roxas. Well, they probably just don't need you there. I'm... I'm heading back. Huh? Maybe you're not completely well yet. No, it's nothing like that. <sighs> Got it! Huh? Got what? On our next day off, let's all go to the beach, huh? The beach? Where did that idea come from? We should go someplace different for a change. You're talking about a vacation with friends. Exactly. Join you, if I can. What are you talking about, Shion? It'll be a blast, trust me. Hmm. Yes, all right. Let's go. I sent Axel to Castle Oblivion last night to help expedite the matter we spoke of. I also instructed him to clear out our facilities there. He should return soon. And what of Namine? Still missing, sir. Ha <laughs> ha! Where or where could she be? Why, Zigbar. It almost sounds as though you know. <laughs> Continue. Somebody accessed our main computer without authorization. And you expect us to believe you really don't know who it was. As if. Little Poppet is turning into a problem. Nonsense. I see no problem whatsoever. Ha <laughs> ha! Well, no! Apparently you don't. Something you find amusing? Ah, the things you hear from a guy with no heart. No matter what unfolds, our plans remain unchanged. Axel, Roxas, and Shion will play the respective roles that Kingdom Hearts has given them. But sir, Shion... Leave it be. How can you not see how perfect this is? In truth, this is more than perfect. Shion is marching right into the arms of destiny, but to destiny's own time. 
We need not take any more steps. All we must do is watch with caution and patience. you'll ever see of these walls, Xion. Uh. <laughs> Axel, what are you doing here? I'm just here on orders, that's all. There's nothing for you to see here. Lies! This is the place I come from, I just know it! What about your mission? Don't be selfish. Or else they'll turn me into a dusk? They'll do worse than turn you into a dusk. They'll just destroy you. And is that because I'm useless? That's not it. Xion, go home. I'm remembering things. I have memories of back when I was a human. Well, stop remembering. Nothing good will come of it. I have dreams every night. And you're in those dreams, Axel. Then they sure aren't memories. How can I be a part of your past? They're just dreams, that's all. You can't fool me. We've met before, Axel. Right here in this castle. No, we have not. Let's go home, Shion. Don't keep Roxas waiting. Please, Axel. You've got to help me. I need to know who I am. Stop! Stay out of there, Shion! You're early. No, you're just late. Today makes 255. What's that about? It's been that many days since I first joined the organization. Man, time flies. So, you got the number memorized, do you? Yeah. Have to hang on to something, right? It's not like I have memories from before the organization. Don't you remember? I acted like a zombie. Right, that first week you could barely form a sentence. But come on, you're still kind of a zombie. Oh, thanks. <laughs> <laughs> hey, Roxas. Bet you don't know why the sun sets red. You see, Light is made up of lots of colors, and out of all those colors, red is the one that travels the farthest. Like I ask, know it all. <laughs> 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 Who I am?
Shion. Surely, you must have known that this was going to happen. Why would I know? Because in your memory, you've been to a number of worlds before you came to this one. And, and of, of course, course, in those worlds, the only thing you met was the Dark Darkness. That's, that's all that's, that's, that's left, left in your heart. Your heart. <sighs> the dark <sighs> darkest memories. <sighs> Your, your memories of Hong Kong. Uh, everyone. That's a lie. I remember everyone from the islands. The islands. They're, They're my, 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 my closest friends. friends. And who uh, threw away those friends? Maybe it's your own actions you've forgotten. It was you who destroyed your home. Who am I? What am I here for? So we meet again. You made me a promise. I remember. It was to look after Sora. I'm sorry. I'm not sure I've kept that promise very well. Can you tell me what's happening? Some of Sora's memories are missing. How could that be? Sora's memories are escaping through Sora's nobody into a third person. And now, they're starting to become a part of her. Isn't there a way to bring back just Sora's memories? If they're still separate, then I think I can take out fragments of it. But, if her memories, and Sora's memory fragments, are completely weaved together, I would need to untangle them from each other, and that would take more time. Which means, it would take even longer, before Sora can wake up again. And Diz wouldn't tolerate that. So what can you do? If I just jump in, and rearrange her memory, then Sora might wake up, only to find out that nobody remembers him anymore. That's a risk I just can't take. It's too late either way. Sora's awakening has already been delayed. Sora's nobody, and the one that's absorbing his memory. None of us imagined that they would fight so hard to become their own people. Unfortunately, the only real solution is for them both to go away. Did you know, her face was blank at first. But now, there is a face that is clearly visible. I think that's proof that she has entered Sora's memories. Sora's memories? Sora's nobody's memories, and her memories. They're all a jumbled mess now, and to put them back into one... I'm afraid there's no other way. All right. Is it that I'm not supposed to exist? Well, what do you want to do, Xion? I want... I want to be... 
with you too. Then come back with us. I can't. Not the way I am now. But what would it take for me to be like you? In a while. You think so? So, I went to the beach today. And there was this girl who looked kind of like Shion. But I couldn't get close enough to tell for sure. I probably imagined it. To be honest, I'm not even sure today's mission really happened. Feels like I just woke up from a dream or something. Do you remember our promise? When we said that the three of us would go to the beach on our next break? Maybe that's why. Maybe I saw Shion there because I wanted her to be there. Wanna go look for her? Huh? Beginning tomorrow, let's use our spare time to find Shion. Mm-hmm. Sounds good. Let's do that. It's no use. You sure you're not forgetting someplace? I've been everywhere I know how to get to. All right. <sighs> the only place I haven't been to is Castle Oblivion. <gasps> it was just the other day that Shion was asking you what the place was like. And the day before she disappeared, you said she was put on an important mission, remember? Yeah, but there's nothing there anymore. Well, Shion might be there. Mm. <sighs> Apparently, Shion comes from Castle Oblivion. What? That's probably why she was asking about the place. I had no idea. Me neither. I only found out a little while ago. Castle Oblivion. Shion. So, this is Castle Oblivion. Roxas! Oh, my... My head! Easy, man. Let's retreat for now and... I'm fine! We have to find Shion. What's happening? Roxas! So much... Rushing into my head. Let's get out of here for now. No, wait. There's something I can almost. Giving up already? I thought you were stronger than that. Riku!
are you all right? What happened to me? You collapsed just as you entered the castle doors. Don't you remember? I only remember going inside. Just take it easy for now. I'm fine. Let's go back to Castle Oblivion. Don't push yourself, man. Who's there? Uh, Shion? Shion! Wait! Out of the way! Hey! Roxas! Wait! I thought the imposter was sighted in Castle Oblivion. Shion. No way that was Shion. The one who ran away first was Shion. But why run? You want to go back? Shion. Where have you been? Axel and I have been looking all over for you. You have? Sorry. Let's go home. If you come back voluntarily, Sykes will let all this drop. He has to. I don't care what he said to you. I'll be there. Me and Axel will make sure... I really can't. Why not? Come on! Wait! <laughs> well, hello there, Shion. Axel? No, wait! Yeah! Stop! Shion! You're sure things are better this way? I never expected you to question it. If you could save one of them, why would you choose the puppet? <clears throat> or put it this way, which would you rather suffer the loss of? Some make-believe friendship? Or a real one? <clears throat> things are finally right again. Of course we're better off this way. Xemnas is exasperated from all the fixing we've had to do. We have to set things right. There's simply too much on the line. Lee. I need to know. About what? Shion. Tell me what happened to her. 
Shion is a valued member of the organization, but she needs her rest. So worry not. Uh. Sora. Sora. <laughs> Who is Sora? The Connection. Connection? He is what makes you and Shion a part of each other's lives. And the reason I placed Shion among our number. If you want her to stay that way, I must insist. You get your mind off these needless distractions. I will have Shion return to her duties tomorrow. Today, you must focus on yours. Understood. Hey, Roxas. Are you certain we've taken suitable measures with Shion and Roxas? I will admit, Shion has strayed from our original designs. However, we are also seeing an interesting side effect. Really? The key. Shion was affected by Roxas, just as we had anticipated. This was indeed what we had hoped to achieve. But then, through Roxas, Sora himself began to shape it into her, giving Shion a sense of identity. Our plan seemed like a failure at this point. But then it occurred to me, Shion is keeping Sora's memories trapped by claiming them as her own. Keeping her close to Roxas will ultimately prevent Sora from ever waking. I see. And what of the imposter? See that he stays away from Roxas. He is merely an impurity that would make Shion's existence incomplete. Then we shall return to our original plan. What am I supposed to do, Riku? Oh no. What has happened? Sora's memory. I'm afraid it stopped. What does that mean? Unless something is done, he'll never wake from his slumber. The gloves must come off then. But... Nobody's never should have existed. As I'm sure you understand, Namine. Yes.
is this? Are you really okay? <laughs> this is getting weird. Huh? Since when do you ever worry about me? What do you mean, weird? Usually I do all the worrying over you. I don't think it's ever been the other way around before. Just feels strange, that's all. Roxas, of course I worry about you. I'm just glad you're back, Shion. Even though it might have been rough on you. Is Axel coming today? Ah, uh, who knows? You didn't fight, did you? How could he? How could that jerk attack you like that? That jerk? Do you mean Axel? But... I wouldn't be sitting here with you if Axel hadn't done that. He's your best friend. I know, but so are you. <laughs> it's just not the same without all three of us. Huh? You need something? Well, um... Something's wrong with Roxas. You don't know why, do you? He says the Keyblade wears him out when he goes to use it. And then today, I was fighting the same way Roxas does. You would know more about Roxas than I do by now. What do you mean? <sighs> well... What do you think, Shion? I'm not sure. Not sure, huh? Is that because you're a puppet? <gasps> you do know that. You're a replica, whose original purpose was to copy Roxas's powers. So if you see Roxas's powers getting weaker, while your powers are getting stronger, it could be that you're robbing Roxas of his powers more than you ought to be. What can I... Then what should I do? You gotta think for yourself. Cause I know you're not just a puppet. We're best friends. You, me, and Roxas, that is. Got it memorized? Sure. Can I ask you just one other thing? What's that? I saw a boy today who looks just like Roxas. <sighs> is he... who I think he is? Sora has a pretty powerful effect on her, is all I'm saying. Yes, it was not supposed to gain a mind of its own, nor become the person we see. But in the end, it only proves that the puppet is the more worthy vessel. The time has come. Syx, are the devices ready? In a matter of days. Good. And what of Roxas? Both of them have connections to Sora, but we only need one of them under our thumb. Whether Shion takes from Roxas the rest of what he has to give, or whether he destroys her first and takes back what is his, there is no change to our plans. No matter how, Sora's power will belong to us.
The way things are, I'm going to wreck everything. What should I do, Riku? <gasps> are you? Riku. Sora's friend. Sora? You know Sora? Yeah. Thank you. You saved me, but I don't know why... you did. I guess... I just felt like it. Riku, please. Tell me more. About Sora and that girl he's always with. You mean Kairi. Kairi. That's right. She's the one who looks so much like me. To Sora, she's someone very special. It's just... I remember things about the two of them. But I'm nothing more than a puppet. Something that somebody created. So why would I have... their memories? Do you know where Sora is now? That secret stays with me. Why's that? Shion. Your memories. They really belong to Sora. So you mean... I'm like... a part of him? When his memories were scattered, some of them... found their way inside you. Now. Sora has been put to sleep so that we can piece together his memory. Except... You can't because part of it is inside of me. That means... He can't wake up. Yeah. You got it. But... If you go with me to Sora right now, we could give the memories inside you back to him. So, do you hate me for taking your friend away from you? Nah. I guess... I'm just sad. I'm sorry. But... I can't go with you, it's my friends. They need me. And I need them too. Maybe... You should take some time and think about it. Figure out who really needs you more. And where you belong. How will I know? Where I belong. Truly. I'm not sure... I can promise you I'll come up with the right answer. Well, the answer you come up with... Can't just be right for you. It has to be one... That works best for everybody. You and your friends, and everyone else. Try. Thank you, Riku. I have to make the most of the time Riku's given me. Brain freeze. <laughs> it's been a while since we all hung out like this, hasn't it? Well, we've had our share of drama lately. I just remembered. Did you know you should be checking your ice cream sticks? Really? Once you finish your ice cream, see if the stick says winner. Oh. Not that I've ever seen one myself. Wait a second. Oh. What is it? Uh, it's nothing. So then, what happens when you win? I'll tell ya, that's a good question. What, you don't know? Well, it's gotta be something nifty if you're a winner, right? Cool. <laughs> wow, the 
sun's beautiful. I know we've seen a lot of sunsets, but today's puts them all to shame. If only things could stay like this forever. Say, what if we all just took off? What? If we ran, I bet we could always be together. But we have nowhere to run. Yeah. I guess you're right. What's important isn't that we hang out with each other every day. As long as we keep each other in our thoughts, we'll never be apart, right? We've got it memorized, Axel. Good. I'll have these moments memorized for a long time. Forever. Me too. Forever. Sora. It appears we've come to a standstill. Yes. This has gone on long enough. Riku, I think you know what needs to be done. Right. Uh, looks like you've meddled again. Sorry, did you say something? The organization doesn't need both of them. Just one will suffice. Stop pretending. Think about that. <laughs> what a blast from the past! Shield, stop! Of all the faces, why do I look at her and see yours? Why is it that you always have to glare at me like that? Shut up! <laughs> I'm sorry, Axel. What are you doing? Please, let me go. I have to do this or else... Just look. Uh. Please, Axel. You have to take care of Roxas. But... You'd be... Please! Thank you, Axel. Explain yourself, Axel. The old man needs to get his eye checked. She just got away. I'll give him that. Can't toss the blame around. And now we're left with the one we can't use. Did something happen? Where's she on? She flew the coop! Flamesy Locks here couldn't trouble himself to clip her wings. Huh? What does he mean, Axel? Your friend sat there sucking his thumb while Shion walked right off. I'm going back to my room. What happened out there? Nothing. Really. Nothing? Shion's gone! How can that be nothing? It's just like Zigbar said. I just sat there sucking my thumb, watching Shion run away. I'm asking you why you did that, and you know it! Shion is like a mirror that reflects you. You're not making any sense. Shion is a puppet created to duplicate your powers. Are you nuts? She owns a person, not a puppet. She's a mirror that reflects you. And when I looked in the mirror, it wasn't you I saw. 
Shion is Shion. You can't expect her to be me. That's not what I mean. It was only a matter of time before someone broke the mirror. You mean... they have to destroy her? <sighs> Answer me! Roxas, if somebody doesn't, then you won't be you anymore. I'll always be me. I'm still your best friend. Just like Shion is my best friend. That's not it. You're missing the whole point, Roxas. Forget this! Roxas! I wish you'd understand, Roxas. Riku. Did you find the answer? Yes. I certainly did. I'm on the verge of losing everything I care about. So please. Please, Riku. Tell me what I should do now. Go to Twilight Town. You'll find a girl there named Namine. Namine? What's she like? You'll find out. I don't think you'll have trouble finding her. All right. Thanks, Riku. Goodbye. Shion has disappeared yet again. Do we know where she is headed? It, not she, is a replica. Merely a puppet. A puppet? What does that mean, exactly? A puppet is a puppet. Talking about the replica program, isn't it obvious? The what -ka? Perhaps you care to enlighten us about this pet project of yours. The purpose was to take a piece of the Keyblade Wielder's memory and copy it, thus making his powers our own. This was one of several projects of ours being undertaken at Castle Oblivion. However, our efforts were severely derailed by Vexen's untimely demise. Needless to say, losing Vexen was not part of our plans. We were also caught off guard when this particular replica we called Shion formed an identity of its own. No one at Castle Oblivion ever reported any instance where a replica formed its own identity. Do you concur, Axel? Mm. Whatever the puppet may decide to do, we can be certain it will no longer have an impact on our plans. Still, it knows our secrets. We need to shorten the leash, perhaps even tighten it. What exactly do you- Axel, the onus is on you to capture and bring back Shion. The escape was on your watch. I will overlook any nicks or scratches. Just ensure she still functions on arrival. Why would you allow a deserter back? We should simply eradicate her. It is not a deserter. It is just a flawed specimen that has wandered out. Are we clear, Axel? Dismissed. Bring her back alive. Is she a madness? All this time, I've been talking to a puppet. So now, we just sweep it up, huh? As if. If only the whispers at the top carried to the bottom. <laughs> Axel, those orders were absolute. <laughs> Still here, Roxas? Proceed with your mission. Shion is... She's 
not a puppet. A puppet couldn't be part of the organization. Just count the seats here. We have and always will be. Thirteen. Axel! Maybe it's best if Sheol never comes back to the organization. Do you really have to do what Semnis says? If I don't, they'll eradicate me next. In that case, can you at least try not to harm her? That's up to her. Roxas, Shion is dangerous. Dangerous? Have you got all your strength back? Not yet. How long have you known about her? Could it be that you've known about her for a long time and not told me anything? Your Majesty. Gosh, have I been worried about you? Where have you been all this time? I've been... searching for a way to conquer the darkness within me. While we wait for Sora to awaken. The way you looked. You don't have to worry about me. I'm getting the hang of keeping the darkness under control. And Sora, did something go wrong with fixing... All his memories? There's a reason the organization has been quiet since our battle at Castle Oblivion. And now I know it's not because a depletion in members had made them weak. Taking Sora's memory apart, piece by piece, was only the first step in what they were trying to do at Castle Oblivion. And I think they needed more time to fix his memory. You know, you and me were both looking into what the organization was up to. But what I saw didn't look like much. Almost. Like they're trying to buy some time. Right. Sora's memories are what they're after. And they needed all this time, until now, to absorb every piece of it. Huh? The process of putting his memory back together has gone nowhere. They have what's most precious to Sora, his memories of Kairi. Well, then you have to let me help. Maybe I could get the memories back. I've got that covered, your magic. I mean, Mickey. Instead, I want to ask you for a favor. What would that be? I have to face one of the organization's members soon. I might not survive the fight. And if I do, it might be because I gave in to the darkness. That means... You're the only one who will be there for Sora, Donald, and Goofy. The only one... who can guide them when they awaken. Riku! Promise me, Mickey. When our friends wake up... you have to be there to help them out. I promise. Riku. Shion. Replica program. Shion was a puppet. Made to replicate my powers. The Keyblade's powers. 
When Shion left the organization, Axel didn't stop her. Like he wanted her to go. Axel's probably known about Shion for some time now. But has kept it from me. Shion and I are both special nobodies. Shion was a replica. A puppet. What about me? Am I a puppet too? Xemnas said, Sora was what connects her and me. But who is Sora? And who am I? supposed to be. Axel, if he's hiding things from me about Shion, what could he be hiding about me? Axel. Hey, Roxas. Did you find Shion yet? You know it isn't gonna be that easy. I suppose not. Have you known about Shion this whole time? No, not the whole time. Since when then? Uh, I can't exactly remember when. Didn't get it memorized, huh? Who am I really? I'm special like Shion, I know that. But the organization wanted me out of the picture. Am I right? Yeah, they did. I guess it's because Shion copied my powers and the Keyblade's powers. And they didn't need me anymore. And Axel, I guess you felt the same way. You're wrong there. You'll always be my best friend. Best friends are supposed to be honest with each other. Who am I, Axel? Xemnas says me and Shion are connected to each other through Sora. I don't even know a Sora. Am I a puppet like Shion? You're different from Shion. Then why do... Finding out the truth doesn't always work out for the best. What makes you so sure about that? I have the right to know the truth. How did I even get here? Why am I so special? Where did I learn how to use the Keyblade? I hardly know who I am. What is so wrong with wanting some answers? Roxas. I need to know, Axel. Please. Who am I? You've just got to trust me, Roxas. I don't. I can't. Roxas! Somebody knows where I came from. If I can't get answers here, I'll get them somewhere else. That'll be the person I trust. I tried, but I have to find out about myself. There's no reason for me to be here anymore. Your mind's made up? Why did the Keyblade choose me? I have to know. 
You can't turn on the organization. You get on their bad side and they'll destroy you. No one would miss me. That's not true. I would. Nice to meet you, Xion. Nominate, are you able to see my face? Yes. Then what do you think I should do? What do you want to do? First, I just wanted to be with Roxas and Axel forever. But then I started to realize that my memories... Well, these aren't really even mine, are they? You're not Sora, and you're not Roxas. You're Kyrie as Sora remembers her. <sighs> as I remember more of my past, the more I feel the need to go back where I came from. What should I do to go back? So you're going back to Sora? Mm. If you return your memories to him, then you will disappear. In exchange for not having your own memory, you're connected through others' memories. So when you disappear, no one will remember you. There won't be any you to remember. For all the powers I possess, I can't keep even one piece of the memory called you connected. I know, I'm ready. Otherwise, I wouldn't be here. I also know that Roxas should be going back with me. But I don't think he would understand. Not yet. I know. Roxas can't feel Sora just yet. Nominee, will you please watch over Roxas once I'm gone? You won't be alone. I asked someone else, too. There just isn't anything else I can do. All right. Thank you. Well, if you're ready, Let's go see Sora. Amine, it's them. The organization has found us. They're almost here. This blasted puppet led them right to our doorstep. See what you get for trusting it. I can handle this. Wait! Shion! Why do I always get stuck with the icky jobs? Axel? Shion, what are you gonna do? I've decided that I have to go back to where I belong. Well, to be honest, I always felt that was best right from the very beginning. But you know, it still really bugs me. Something about this just stinks. It's for the good of everyone. But how do you know that? Everybody thinks they're right. This is right. They're gonna destroy you! <laughs> Please don't hold back, Axel. Promise. What's your problem? You both think you can do whatever you want. Well, I'm sick of it. Go on, you just keep running. But I'll always be there to bring you back! Why 
Now you gotta cause me so much trouble. <laughs> Where did I think I could go? What a joke. Shion! Thank you. Roxas, I'm out of time. Even if I'm not ready, I have to make this choice. You have poured so many memories into me, given me so much that I feel like I'm about to overflow. Look at me, Roxas. Who do you see? If you see somebody else's face, a boy's face, then that means I'm almost ready. This puppet will have to play her part. Roxas? This is him. It's Sora. <sighs> You're next, Roxas. I have to make you a part of me, too. Don't you see? This is why I was created. Who are you? Again? It's weird. I feel like I'm forgetting something really important. You'll be... better off now, Roxas. Am I the one who did this to you? No. It was my choice to go away now. Better that than to do nothing and let Xemnas have his way. Sora. And now I am going back to be with him. Roxas, I need you to do me a favor. All those hearts that I've captured, kingdom hearts, set them free. Kingdom hearts? Free them? Mm -hmm. It's too late for me to undo my mistakes. But you can't let Xemnas have Kingdom Hearts. You can't. Goodbye, Roxas. See you again. I'm glad I got to meet you. And of course, Axel too. You are both my best friends. Never forget. That's the truth. Uh, no! Shion! Who else will I have ice cream with?
she on? <laughs> How did this happen? What does it matter? I'm here for you. Why are you trying to stop me? Because I want back the rest of Sora's memories. Sora? Enough about Sora! Do you have some kind of plan? I'll set Kingdom Hearts free. Then everything will be the way it was. She'll come back. And the three of us can be together again. You mean Shio? It's a struggle just to remember the name now. Either way, I can't let you go doing anything crazy. I'm freeing Kingdom Hearts, and I'm going to find Sora. I want Shion back. I want my life back! If you try and make contact with Kingdom Hearts, the last thing you'll get is your life back. The organization will destroy you. Enough! Yeah. Why? Why do you have the Keyblade? Shut up! Don't you quit! Come on, Sora. I thought you were stronger than that. Huh? Get real. Look which one of us is winning. Uh. So it's true. 
You really are his nobody. Guess Diz was right after all. What are you talking about? I am me! Nobody else! Riku, please! You have to stop him! How many times do I have to beat you? All right. You've left me with no other choice. What? I have to release the power in my heart. The dark power that I've been holding back. Even... if it changes me forever. Accepted it. Diz. He could feel Sora. Oh, he told you how he felt, did he? Ridiculous. Nobody cannot feel anything. If he had met Sora, things might have been different. Roxas, don't be sad. I came from you and Sora. I am you, the same way that I am Sora. You'll forget me, but the memories themselves will never go away. Memories of you and me will always be together, forever inside him. <laughs> 